Hi, Cancer. Getting ready to do your reading. Let's see what's showing up for you. Let's do a reading to see you and your person, the situation, how they're feeling right now, how you're coming across. All right, so overall energy, Ten of Coins. How they feel about you, the Nine of Swords, what they plan to do. Wow. How you're coming across and, the, okay, your person is worried, they're scared or sad. They are afraid that they're losing you. So they're going to come across as everything's fine in their world. They see you as having some sort of victory. And, hmm, they're sad. Wow. So they're thinking that the two of you are over. The Four of Cups just slipped out. I'm going to put it back, but it is, I think they think you're not going to take their cut. So overall energy is the Ten of Coins. Ten of Coins. Something here, like you push them away, you don't want them anymore. Maybe you are with someone else or you've been talking about someone else or talking to someone else. You might be dealing with a Scorpio. Um, under the deck is Justice, though. There's something here where you put your foot down, Cancer, is what I'm kind of feeling here. You may have gotten a new job or something or this is a new relationship that's coming in. So this is usually my I'm pushing someone away card. I'm looking at somebody new and it's over. It's over between us. So someone is seeing like the end between the two of you, what I'm seeing here. And how they feel is the Nine of Swords. The Sun, the Four of Swords, the Two of Coins. I want to take one more. It's kind of like this person's world is crashing down. It's almost like they want to make a mess. I feel, okay, you know, this is not for all of you. I don't have enough cards here, but I kind of feel like for some of you, this might be kind of like a narcissist energy where everything has evolved around them this whole time and now all of a sudden you're making some sort of new strides in your life it could be a new relationship a new job you're going back to school you're doing something for yourself maybe you won an award maybe something you know something you're doing really well i mean you could be with this person still but let's say like you took up a really um like a new hobby and you're doing really well at it and you're top of your class or you know or like if you're working out you look really good this person is noticing the changes in you they notice that you don't want to be around them maybe as much you've got new people in your life something like that maybe you're doing really well at work you're getting a promotion it's kind of like they were just going with the status quo things are fine now all of a sudden they're they're looking back like they want things to go back to the way they were they could be acting like they don't care up until this point your person might also be a little lazy maybe they never really put effort or time into the connection of the four swords as well some of you may be dealing with an ex, possibly the Six of Cups, but probably not for most of you, because that's actually how they feel about you. What they plan to do is a fool. So, it's like they've already attempted to do something to win you back or keep you from moving on, or they plan to do this, but with the Five of Cups and Strength card, it looks like you're going to turn them down or you're just not interested. It's like, okay, this feels like this is, you know, this isn't ha already happened for some of you, but this is like they try to win you back. They want things to go the way, back to the way they were. They may, they may try to give you something and you're going to say, no, I don't want it. And they may act like everything's fine in their world with a fool. They don't care. Your energy is a Six of Wands. So you're coming across as... You keep telling them things that like everything's going good in your life. Page of Wands, High Priestess, Nine of Wands, like they're tired of hearing it. Also, some of you have worked very hard and this, whatever you are, whatever this victory is, you, it's a hard one. You've done really well. It's like you keep telling them something over and over. It's hard for you to explain it. I can see it clearly what's going on in the reading. It's like you've moved on. You keep having victories. This may be someone who you left a year ago, but they're still interested in you, Cancer, something like that. So the potential outcome is the Seven of Swords. I think this person is just going to try to think of ways to maybe try to win you back or make you jealous. They're going to act like things don't matter. Um, you could be moving on to possibly a fire sign for some of you. There may be a Virgo involved in this. Again, we have Pisces and Scorpio here as well as, well as Leo. But um, I think your person, there's a person here. This kind of feels like an ex, though, who may try to come back 
and win you back one more time with one more conversation or some big gift or you know they may give try to give you commitment seven of cups justice I'm getting the feeling this person didn't take you um, seriously when you were together like they took you for granted and I kind of get like this is it you're done you're moving on or you moved on so what is going on here they could be regretting some past choices, though I don't really see it here. The Five of Cups is obviously sad, but they're definitely spying on you. They also have, they want to communicate with you, and they are going to be back. They'll be back, and they're going to try to take you out. So specifically, yeah, they're coming back to take you out on a date night. They may be trying to take you um, on vacation that's under the deck. They may want to go travel with you. So your person doesn't want to give up on you, Cancer. This person doesn't want to... Um, it's almost like they cheer you on. Like they seem like they're happy for you, but I don't want judgment. Yeah. I'm also getting for some of you, this is a friend vibe. All of a sudden I got, this is someone who hasn't really told you that they have feelings for you and they keep seeing you do well. It's like they almost like they want you to do poorly so that you can stay with them or come back to them as well. Like every time you tell them that some, about something good that's happened in their life or your life, um, it's like they feel you moving on a little more and a little more each time. So on one note, there are a lot of good things here going on for you, what I'm seeing. So I don't know if they've already come in or they're going to be coming in, but I do see a lot of positive energy for you, Cancer. Some of you will be going on some sort of vacation or travel that you may not realize right now. Others of you, you could be getting a job or a new job or something like that that's coming in. I just see you doing really well, like you are... Um, like pursuing your goals. Let's see what this person would say to you. I feel like it's your time to shine too, Cancer. I feel like you've been kind of hidden for a while. Like you spent the last couple of years maybe kind of like hidden in the shadows, not really um, doing anything, getting from... Some of you were passed over for a promotion is what I'm getting. There's something about not being promoted. You were supposed to be promoted, but you weren't. So, but you will be, or you'll be receiving a new job or something along that line. It says, you always have a special place in my heart no one else can fill. I never truly moved on, even though I appear so. I made so many bad mistakes. I hope we can have a do-over. And if I could turn back time, I would and do things differently. So there's a lot of regret on this person's part. Let me go to, let me go to this one. Treasure Island. It's interesting because I know there's a lot of good things here going on for you. Now, some of you may have new love. And this is this reading is based on a past person. That may be what's coming in next. You may be meeting a fire sign or someone who you have a lot of passion for. But there's definitely some good things going on besides this person. Now, some of you, like this just may be someone that you... The reading's either based on someone you may reconcile with if you wanted to or just somebody in your past who is watching you move on. So take that part as it resonates because wherever the person is the reading's about, I don't feel like you're getting back together with them. They may try to win you back. So if you do want to reconcile with someone though, this is coming up as a reconciliation. So I'm sorry, I think it's kind of getting confusing. So I feel like there could be two different sets of you watching. I can read this two completely different ways. It's kind of what I'm picking up. So I don't want to be confusing. Because someone is sad that you're moving on. And I'm feeling like for some of you, this is almost like a friend who's not telling you how they're really feeling. And they keep seeing you inch farther and farther away from you. Another group of you, I feel like this is an ex who regrets not putting in the effort into the relationship. Something like that. Some of you, I feel like there may be like even a narcissist type of energy. Someone who just doesn't care, didn't care, whatever. Um, and you probably wouldn't want anything to do with that person. So, all right, I'm going to leave it there, Cancer. Have a really good week.